Today we'd like to give you an overview of our Kipware EDU, a CNC programming training and reference software series. The series consists of milling, a milling version, uh, a turning version, a multi-axis turning version, a Fanuc Macro B version, and a manufacturing engineering version. Each Kipware EDU title is laid out in an ebook or electronic book format. Training series cover the basics to the complex and users can follow the curriculum from start to finish or can easily jump to any title or any topic that they desire. Here we'll take a sample trip around the Kipware EDU mill version. All the titles work similar, so if we take a look at the mill version, this is the same format for uh, the turning version as well as the multi-turn version. Uh, the beginning page, the opening page, uh, will give you a launch button where you can launch into the table of contents of the software. This page is going to give you a complete a list of, of everything that's uh, inside the software from the programming basics to M codes and G codes uh, all the way down to complex shape and uh, CNC controls. Uh, so if you're learning CNC programming, you can just follow this curriculum from start to finish. Uh, and basically it'll start out with the basics of programming and then gradually get a little bit deeper and deeper into G code programming as you go through the curriculum. But Kipware EDU is not only a training software, it's also a reference software. Uh, so what we do on the side menu bar is give you the ability to quickly jump into any topic that you'd like. Uh, so if you want to see something about what our tool offsets, uh, basically you can jump right into this, this category. Or if you've learned programming training and then have a question about what you've learned, uh, very easily come back into the software and then uh, jump uh, into a title or into a topic uh, that you need some particular information for. Each topic covered inside Kipper EDU contains either an in-depth text explanation or when we get into deeper things like the G-code programming, the user can get an in-depth text explanation as well as an animation of the code. The animation is a video showing the code in use with the voice explanation of what's happening on the screen. So the user can either watch the video for each of the codes or you can jump ahead into the format and you can specifically look for something that you're looking for. You can see from this example that as the cutter moves you can see that the program that's generated using the code is highlighted and the voice explanation tells how the code is being used. You can see from our table of contents that Kipware EDU is a complete programming training series. It follows everything from the programming basics through things like programming format, M codes, G codes, and then gets into the more complex areas of programming with subprogramming, how to program complex shapes, and then a variety of CNC controls. Kipware EDU teaches the Fanuc style of G code programming, which is about 95% of the controls on the market. In addition to that, Kipware EDU gives you the opportunity to compare the Fanuc style of programming that was taught in the series with the other controls available out on the real world. So you learn the Fanuc style of programming and then we tell you the differences between programming uh, for a variety of different, uh, different controls. Here we'll take a look at the turning version and you can see that the layout of the turning version is very similar to that of the milling version. With the launch button uh, we can see our table of contents and then kind of the same information available uh, through programming basics all the way through the variety of different CNC controls. Again, if we look at a G-code, uh, we'll look at something like a, uh, let's say, a stock removal and turning. Uh, we can see an in-depth explanation of that stock removal and turning, or we can watch a video animation of how, this, how that code particular works. And again, the user can either watch the video that has a voice text explanation of what's happening on the screen, or the user can automatically increase the file so that you can look for a specific area that's of interest. Here's a view of our multi-turn version. Again, the layout very similar to milling and turning. Uh, with our table of contents, uh, we can look at uh, some multi-axis basics, which is basically describing the types of multi-axis machines that are out on the market, uh, y-axis machines, as well as uh, c-axis indexing controls. 
Uh, we also have our G codes that we can use. So again, if you want to look at a G code, uh, you can look at an in-depth text explanation of the G code, or again, you can go to an animation of the G code, and you can either watch the video or increase uh, the fields, the format, so you can look for something in specifically. Here's a look at the Kipware EDU Fanuc Custom Macro B version. Again, the similar similar layout, and basically we go from uh, the very basics of custom macro, why you would use it, how you can use it, uh, through in-depth macro variables and the functions available. Uh, we have a macro test uh, that you can go through that you can test your knowledge of macros, but we also have a real neat video tutorial series. Uh, this video tutorial series will show you a video with a voice uh, explanation of how to create uh, simple macros uh, through complex macros. Here we have one that uh, creates a bolt circle, uh, how to generate alarms. Uh, basically the video tutorial series uh, is a great uh, companion to the in-depth text explanations that are available in the software to show you how you would use the macro and how you can create macros. And finally a look at the Kipware EDU manufacturing engineering version. If you're just getting started in programming or you're just getting started in uh, metalworking, this is a great little series uh, to give you an outline view of some of the basics of metalworking. And you can see from our uh, table of contents that we have uh, the basics of chips and chip formation, uh, cutting tool geometry, uh, machining economics. Uh, we go through cutting tools, cutting fluids, and the types of machines that are available. So if you're just getting into metalworking, uh, the ME version is a nice version to have as a companion for your metalworking experience, uh, not necessarily your G-code programming. So the combination of the G-code programming training and the ME version will give you a nice overview of uh, metalworking and programming. Kipware EDU mill and turn versions come with some companion applications. One of them is the testing wizard, uh, we have a mill version and a lathe version. Uh, basically the user can select from a list of shapes and then use the software to input coordinates and g-codes and plot their toolpath along the predefined shapes. Uh, that's available in the milling uh, as well as the turning version. Also we have an operator panel trainer and the operator panel trainer gives the ability for the user to learn about the buttons uh, that are available on a most CNC machines. One of the nice options available with the Kipware EDU series is our Kipware TP toolpath plotting software. Kipware TP is a full G-code editor, so you can create your G-codes inside the editor, and then you can watch the toolpath being plotted directly to the screen. So Kipware TP is an editor and a toolpath plotting software, and Kipware TP works for milling, turning, and live tool turning programs. So Kipware TP is a nice companion application, and it's an option with the Kipware EDU series. Uh, this can also be used in the real world, so once you are out and doing some programming uh, out in the real world, you can take, take Kipware TP with you, and you can use it to create your G-code programs and to plot and prove out your G-code programs uh, on the floor. So that's a little bit of an overview of the Kipware EDU series. Uh, we'd like to thank you for your software interest, and you can get more information on Kipware EDU uh, at our website, which is uh, www.kentechinc.com. And that's K-E-N-T-E-C-H-I-N-C dot com.